Hey there, my name is Mark, and I live here in my parents' attic. It's a really great room, but it's running out of space because we store so much stuff up here. Luckily, that won't be the case for long, because I just got an email this morning from my future self, who wrote this poem after my future self won U-Storage's video contest. So thank you so much, U-Storage, and this poem is for you. Thank you, oh thank you, Ustorit.com, for cleaning my attic, therefore pleasing my mom. I had so many things that were taking up space that now I can share with the whole human race. My possessions and storage, they tell my life story, which I now will explain in this brief oratory. As a small child, after being paid for my chores, my purchase of choice always involved Star Wars. The collection multiplied over the years, and if you opened the toys, I would cry many tears. But time moved on, and Star Wars lost its cool until I was a Wookiee in a video for school. <laughs> Our film was ridiculous, a nice little movie, so I decided telling stories was really quite groovy. But actors and scripts, that just wasn't my thing, so documentaries became where I sought to be king. I studied in college how to tell people's stories, and in the process learned loads of life's glories. You see, everyone has a story that needs to be told, the rich and the poor, the young and the old. As my studies progressed, Africa became my topic of choice, a beautiful place where I could help lend a voice. No. So two years of travel and ten countries later, my attic collection had grown even greater. Hundreds of videotapes and stories to share, cloths and bags, and new clothes to wear. Newspapers, maps, bottles, and art. With my African items, I did not want to part. For each single item was an amazing story to be told, like this poster from when Nelson Mandela turned 90 years old. It's stories like this that I need to share, and the items that tell them need proper safe care. I have a whole life to live, thousands of stories to tell, and memorable items make sure they're told well. So thank you, you story, that I came out on top, and for giving me space so the stories won't stop.